Good morning. Um, I'd like to share with you this morning that uh, I did a band to not twist up last night. Um, this is what I look like. I did it quite small. I wanted to get a tight cool to see what I get. I've been having some problems with my curls. I don't know. So I said I'll try a tighter curl last night. That's very good. So I part my hair and I applied uh, what you call a hair pudding at the roots I like it I find it kind of like swells up the, the new growth makes it more pronounced I use this at the root of the hair on each section and the balance of, my, of the hair I apply the African Kusa 100% African uh, creamy butter share butter it's a creamy share butter all right um, now you see with my knots now I use oh let me show you what I do since my hair I normally do the bantu knots with on my relaxed hair and when I twist it as the hair is so straight it doesn't stay together if I don't apply something to keep it down with a clip or something so I use these I think my daughter calls them, calls them a woogie or whatever you call them a thingy I bought the very small ones so when I wrap the knots I just reinforce it with these so I'm going to take them down now so you can see what it looks like and see what kind of result I get all right I think I may have gotten all. So what I do, I untwist them in the direction, opposite, opposite direction to when I was twisting it. So if I twist them to the right, I will untwist it to the left direction. Okay. And when I twist up one, I just kind of separate it into two at that time. Sometimes it might be a little frizzy, but you know, I work with it. I noticed too, like when I put all these products in my hair, it takes a little longer to dry and in doing that now my hair ends up being frizzy when it's dry uh -huh, I don't know. another thing I need to work on too as well See the one to the top. Normally, these take a long to dry. Let me see. Okay, not so bad. Let me just separate it. Okay, that should be okay. Let's do the rest quickly. We call this Bantu knot in Trinidad, where I'm from, we call it corkscrew. Um, <laughs> is only when I heard about this Bantu knot, I said, what is that? And then when I saw it, I said, I know that, because my mom used to comb it, uh, comb my hair into uh, what we call corkscrew style when I was a young child, you know. And um, I think they call it uh, also two pigtails. Um, I can't remember the other names, but I, when I do remember the names, I would um, give you the list of it. I have a list of it on my blog. So I will give you the list when I review the blog. I have the names on that. Oh, let me do this quickly. still have some things that I didn't get down. Alright, y'all. I need my glasses. Where is it? Oh, here it is. I'm sure still of the, some of them are still wet. I could feel it. Okay. Pick the 
this one a bit kind of tight. Everybody's down now, all are out. You can see how it looks like. Okay, nice and soft. Alright, let me see if I could style this now. It's a style that I saw that I like. But uh, normally it's like with the hair down here, but I sweat so much I try to keep it away from my face. So normally I do a finger, I comb out my curls with my finger, but I may have to stop doing that because in doing that, he may get a bit frizzy. Alright, let me just do it like this. You can style it in how that you want. You can put your scarf on, you can put your head scarf on. It looks cute, I like the clothes that is, and I love this. Yeah. Okay. Um, 